What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Sass, and I'm back with another one straight facts. If you haven't already, make sure you drop those comments down below. Subscribe to this channel. Make sure you hit the bell on the side to get notified when a girl posts. And last but not least, make sure you like this video up. Like this one, the last one, the last one, and the last one before that. Do those steps for your girl. So today, I am continuing the episode of The Talks with Sass. So, me and my best friend was talking last night, and that's what made me do this, y'all. I promise y'all, like, in high school, like, people knew, in high school, people knew, hold up. Yeah, so in high school, y'all already know I love sitting in the car, and y'all already know I got food. I gotta stop, I got to stop, but I got weed at. I got weed at. Get into it. Yeah. Ooh, y'all see that smoke coming from that? Yeah, so me and my best friend was talking last night, and that's what made me do this video, y'all. So, like in high school, people knew, like, I don't know, people used to try the fuck out of me. Not people, because I was cool with pretty much like the whole, my whole class, or whatever the case may be, but. It was only maybe like three, maybe three girls or whatever. And maybe one boy. Well, like boys, the boys in my stand, my class, like they used to be, they they was childish. They was like, they be will be doing too much. Like they used to piss me off, y'all. And I used to be hating, like, I ain't gonna, I ain't kill me. You know how like in um in school they be like, you know, if you know if I'm cheating, I'm supposed to help another person cheat, you know. Uh, it said a class that cheat together, succeed together, or some shit like that. So, I ain't like none of them. Like, they used to be pissing me off. Like, they was childish as fuck. So, that's what, you know, got me to do this, um, this story time. So, If y'all follow me on Instagram, I got on live last night. And my best friend got on my live. And we was talking about this dude. Most likely, he don't watch my stuff, so I'm going to say his name anyways. But his name was Dre Sean. J. Sean or Dre Sean? I think it was Dre Sean. Yeah. Oh, y'all. I love these little, um, what's am Like, tenders. These things be so good. I should have asked for some hot sauce. I thought I felt like it was gonna extra charge me. This shit be so good. And before I went back to Baton Rouge, before I go back to Baton Rouge, I had to do this. Like I had to. But anyways. The dude Rashawn. He used to always, like, aggravate the fuck out of me. Like, I used to be like, hold on. No, never mind. Yeah, hold on. Hold on. He used to, um, he used to aggravate the fuck out of me. Like, every time, like, I would see him or we see each other. I think we had, like, one or two classes together. I think this is my... Yo, this was so long ago. I think this was my sophomore year. Because he ended up either getting expelled from something else. You know, he was like a trouble child. He stayed in trouble. I think he was like selling drugs. I don't know. He looked like the type. But he ended up getting expelled. But I think this was either my sophomore year or junior year. Yo, this boy, every time I walk in the hallway, he used to be like mugging me. Or he'll say some type of fat joke. It don't bother me. It never did bother me. Um, but coming from him, he used to just be aggravating with it, like, and then be trying to make people laugh, make a scene. Like, nigga, like, this is one specific day. I don't know what it was. I don't know if it, because we used to be going, like, tick from tech every day. Like, he'll tell me something, I tell him something. Like, we used to be ribbing each other. He used to get mad and just probably walk off. I used to get mad and probably walk off. I don't even remember 
like what was actually said and what we used to do and stuff like that but i just remember this one specific day um we was in we was in if y'all went to lake area y'all know who i'm talking about and if um y'all took coach barbino y'all know the coach i'm talking about but we was in we was in her uh pe class and at the time like i think like split up in semesters we used to take health education like the first semester and then like the reg the regular physical education the next semester so like in the springtime we used to take the physical education like go outside we used to play kickball basketball not basketball flag football everything um y'all i used to love me some kickball but <laughs> but um yeah we used to play i mean we that so i'm getting all off topic so this one specific day we was um in the health class we was um we didn't go outside this day or whatever we was in the class and i just got fed up y'all i just got fed up i he just was aggravating like he used to tell me shit every day every day and i just got tired of it so he had told me something i don't even know what the hell i said it's, it this was so long ago y'all i was probably like 15 15 or 16. all i remember was ooh, i couldn't do that i'd be too scared <laughs> man. but this one specific day i don't know what was said i don't know what happened i don't know nothing all i know was he told me something and I told him something back, and I just clicked the hell out. I just clicked out. I told him, I don't know what the fuck I said. <laughs> I ain't even going to lie to y'all. But. 1947? Mm-hmm. That's you? Mm-hmm. All right. Thank you. Yeah. That's living proof. My mama always ordering something. But, um, I don't even know what I said. But. He had did something. Ooh, he had did something. <laughs> and I picked up a chair and I threw it at his ass. I sure did. I ain't give a damn. He was pissing me off. Like, I don't know what it was. I don't know what it was. And he was just like aggravating every day, every day. I just got tired of it. And I don't know what the hell he said that day, but I just clicked out. And. The teacher, Coach Rabino, she rolled me up. She's put me out the class. And she said, don't you ever disrespect the class or don't you ever disrespect me or something like that. Some, something she said, y'all my bad. If y'all saw that. But she said, don't you ever disrespect this class or disrespect me or something she said. And I said, this dude sitting up here telling me, telling me shit and you ain't telling him nothing. I said, you know what, fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. I walked out and um uh, I think I wrote yeah, I think she wrote me up. And I had went home and I told my mama everything, whatever, and her and her ex husband at the time had came to the school and was like pointing out point point the dude out. I pointed the dude out and I forgot what happened. But all in all to say um, when I had got on a dance team, got got on a dance team, my I don't know if this was junior year or senior year, but he had ended up coming to the school for something. Mind you, I told he told y'all he was um expelled. I mean, yeah, I think he was expelled. I don't know. Oh, he went to another school. I don't damn know. But he come to the school. Um, I think i was last getting picked up like always i used to be always last getting picked up and he was like you know all the times i used to mess with you i liked you and i'm like what like them days used to piss me off because i never did that boy nothing like never never did that boy nothing but he used to piss me off and I'm going to tell you another thing used to piss me off. When. I don't know y'all. I was a teacher's pet. I was a teacher's pet. 
And it's called everybody my mama, sister, best friend. Like my um my tin grill. I used to call my biology teacher my bestie. <laughs> <laughs> y'all but what used to piss me off the most was when the students like they used to be disrespecting the teacher like i used to be pissed off like especially when a teacher like when they know a teacher not capable of like you know putting their foot down and stuff like that i remember my senior we had um now two teachers had got into it the two teachers got into it and we had got a substitute named Miss Abel. And she was a white little lady. Didn't bother nobody. Lady used to like um fishing and stuff like that. And they used to mess over that lady. They used to mess over her. And I used to be like, Y'all so damn dumb. I used to be going off on them kids. Like y'all so damn dumb. Y'all sit there and disrespect the dog on lady and wonder why the hell y'all failing. And that lady gave me a certificate for um most outstanding in biology in biology too. Uh, yeah, this is my senior year. No, that's to piss me off. But I just wanted to give y'all that story time, cause like when my best friend was just talking about how you know this dude used to piss me off, and all in all, this dude liked me the whole time. Yeah, I just wanted to share this little story time with y'all, just so you know let y'all know how like how i used to be in high school like dudes would like dog you i would talk about you and everything and come to find out they like you but um i hope you enjoyed this story time the talks with says make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to life of sassy make sure you tell them come join the plush gang 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 and to the new subscribers thank y'all for subscribing i love y'all and welcome to the family we out what? Alright. Uh, Three cups. Gang! Uh, gang! I got.